Hello, my name is Garrett Shaw. I'm 35. I live in Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, I work for the Georgia Institute of Technology, and I'm also a recent Survivor super fan. A little story about that is didn't really watch Survivor growing up. Uh, we got into it when the pandemic started after watching Winners at War. Um, been, been kind of cranking through seasons, and we got so into it. I had my first child. I became a dad in January of this year, 2021. Um, and we were so into the shows that we had to bring the laptop with us to the hospital so we wouldn't miss an episode and ended up busting out the laptop and watching some episodes of Survivor Gabon uh, while my wife was in labor. And then continued to watch throughout the night uh, as, our, as our little guy was sleeping in the, the bassinet in our room. Uh, so I'm pretty sure every time he hears the, the Survivor theme song, uh, he's in for, he knows he's in for a treat. Uh, so why do I want to play Survivor? Well, besides my super fan status, uh, the more we watched, the more I realized I thought uh, I'd be pretty good at it. I think I'd have a good shot. Um, how I'd interact with uh, the other members of my tribe. Basically, um, I moved around a lot in my life. I was a Navy brat growing up. I've lived in 10 different states. And I kind of take the same approach. Just you have to feel everybody out. You have to observe, a lot of observing. Um, try not to give away too much about what's in your, your head. Ask a lot of questions. Um, understand who's getting along with who, watch the team dynamic. And then, uh, you know, once I figure that out, I can insert myself in the best way I think possible uh, to put me in a good spot to make the merge. And then after the merge, I think my strategy would be to uh, kind of downplay the challenges a little bit up front and then hopefully go on a run. I think that's how I'd play it. <clears throat> uh, some other reasons why I think I'd be good at Survivor. I'm an avid backpacker, so I've spent a lot of time kind of in the backwoods. I kind of understand what it's like being in the elements. Um, I know Survivor is a whole different game when you talk about 39 days, uh, but it's something that I am used to. Uh, so um, I kind of know a little bit about what I'd be getting myself into, and I'm excited for the challenge. And why now? Well, uh, I happen to be at this point in my life where um, I'm an engineer. I've been an engineer, uh, you know, my entire career. Not quite sure that was what I wanted to do with my life. It's treated me well. And, you know, recently my wife and I have been talking about starting a business or doing something different. And, uh, and then we were all, you know, as we got into Survivor, it was, oh, maybe I should apply to Survivor. And it's all kind of coming together. And I think, uh, you know, playing Survivor, being out there uh, kind of disconnected will give me a chance to really think about what's important to me, what I'm passionate about in my life. And then hopefully uh, when I return, I uh, really have that, that, um, the, those goals in my head and, and that clear vision in terms of what I want to do with the rest of my life. And I think this is just the perfect time for me to do that. Um, as I'm, as I'm kind of okay financially and, and we've been talking about doing something different as it is. So, uh, that's it. That's a short, short little, uh, intro to myself. And I appreciate you guys taking the time to review this video and I just can't wait to see you, Jeff.